Hey, what's up everybody? True Boxing here. Thank you for coming back to get hit with the truth. <clears throat> so the boxing awards are coming, um, but today's video is going to be the Joshua versus Naganu is on video. Um, as Anthony Joshua collides with Francis Naganu on Saturday, March 9th on the zone. Now, before we get into that, if you could smash the like button, leave a comment or subscribe to the channel. I really do appreciate any and all support that I can get as I continue to build my channel here. So Joshua, and, well, first again, the boxing awards are coming. I have to, I just finished my top tens this past week. I almost got them fully um, uh, uploaded. Uh, with the heavyweight division and then um i'm gonna do the weekly stuff that i that i usually do um the weekly videos um and then i will start the boxing awards which are almost fully complete um i only have a couple more awards to finish up um but this video is on the anthony joshua versus francis naganu heavyweight showdown that's taking place on march 9th as it will main event a DAZN card from Saudi Arabia. Um, you know, kind of not a surprise here. You had Francis Naganu who almost upset Anthony Joshua, the WBC heavyweight champion, <coughs> lost the 10 round split decision to him in a close fight and, um, and took a knockdown as well. And that was Naganu's first ever fight. So he's taken on the former Three, our former two-time unified heavyweight world champion Anthony Joshua who probably had the best year of any heavyweight overall as he went 3-0 and and, um, and scored two knockouts but especially his uh, his knockout of Otto Wallen on the day of reckoning uh, the zone pay-per-view card where he main evented but this one is very intriguing very interesting because Naganu is not going to be a surprise now. And he even admitted that. He said he feels Joshua will be ready for him, that he is no longer a surprise. And now, following that performance against Fury, what kind of fight are we going to see here? You know, Anthony Joshua wants to get um, Tyson Fury. If Tyson Fury comes out of Alexander, the Alexander Usyk uh, clash as the undisputed champion. Um, and... The, Saudi, uh, the Turkish, uh, His Excellency said that he um, he wanted to put on that fight uh, the winner of uh, Fury Yusik to fight the winner of Joshua Naganu. But the problem is, is the winner of Fury Yusik, the loser has a an automatic rematch clause in their contract that they can activate, and I believe they will. So. Is that a real possibility, though? If the if the loser loses convincingly between Fury and Usyk, can can the uh, the you know the Turkish prince or whatever he is, can he um, a Turkish? I'm sorry, <laughs> his name is Turkey, Allah something. Can that guy from Saudi Arabia? Can he guarantee that money? Um, you know, to the loser of the fight, can he guarantee him that he'll get a title shot later on? Buy him out of that rematch clause we'll see we'll see how it all shakes down but the winner of fury and naganu they have to happen first and the winner of fury u6 happening three weeks before that so it's going to be very intriguing to see what goes down between anthony joshua and francis naganu i'm really looking forward to it excuse me i think it's uh it's an intriguing fight after the way naganu looked against uh fury and the way joshua has looked recently as he's especially in his last fight he kind of took on his old form um and people are thinking that the fire's back for anthony joshua and we're definitely going to see how it all plays out saturday march 9th on the zone pay-per-view i mean actually no I, I believe it's on a friday night now no it's actually friday um friday march 8th i believe uh is when that fight is going to play take place that fight card so we'll see we'll see what happens but um that's pretty much it that's what i got that's my 2020 um i mean jesus i'm drawing a blank that's my joshua versus naganu is on video as anthony joshua will collide with former ufc heavyweight champion francis naganu on march 8th on the zone i hope you enjoyed the video if you did 
smash the like button, leave a comment, or subscribe to the channel. I appreciate any and all support. This is True Boxing. You've been hit with the truth.